Hey, Dom, I guess just generally, what are your thoughts about what happened out there between you and Alvarado? Uh, grateful, you know, passionate game. Um, you know, uh, he said some things and, you know, I said some things and uh, it's just part of the game, you know, late in the game, made a big pitch and, you know, he got me out. So uh, he wanted to express his emotions. I know, um, you know, Rojas said that that he thought Alvarado crossed the line a little bit with the way that he came after you, you know, after celebrating from, again, from your vantage point, was it over the top what Alvarado did? I mean, I don't mind people pimping strikeouts, pimping stuff on the field. Um, I've never been a player like that, um, but I don't mind it. I love it. But, I mean, him pointing at me, coming after me and stuff like that. Uh, I mean, I'm a grown-ass man. You know, come meet me then if you really got a problem. And we could really handle it. So that's how I look at that issue. You know, he waited for his team to grab him and stuff. But, you know, I'm right there. And he could beat me in the tunnel tomorrow if he really want to get after it, you know. Your next question is from Tony DeComo. What what exactly did he say to you, Don? Because it looked like he was pointing at his head at one point. What did he say? Yeah, um, it's a, it's a good question. Uh, I don't speak Spanish, so I can't <laughs> really interpret uh, everything he said. Um, yeah, he was pointing at his head. He was pointing at me. He was pointing, like, down the middle. He was saying stuff, but, you know, obviously he, he felt some type of way um, because – you know, I yelled at him when he went up and in a Conforto and then hit Conforto. I mean, he hit four of our guys. Um, you know, like their manager said, you know, if you can't throw strikes, you shouldn't be in a big league. So um, I, I'm going to protect my guys. He's throwing 100 out there, and it's not it, it's not okay to just, you know, hit guys. Obviously, he had not hit me. I mean, he made a pitch. I didn't look around until he started doing whatever he was doing. So that's why I reacted the way I reacted, um, and, and that's all I have to say about that. And just from a baseball perspective, uh, when they walk JD in front of you, what kind of goes through your mind there going into that spot? Uh, you know, it's just respect to to JD, what he's doing out there. And at the end of the day, I know how good I am. I mean, I love that. And, you know, it's early in the year. I'm not swinging it the best, but um, I love how, you know, they don't think I could get the job done. I'm not working into a good count. Um he actually threw a pitch up that was ball four, but, you know, he got the benefit of the doubt, and then he made two more pitches I swung through, but I'll see him down the line, so I'm not too worried about it. Thank you. Your next question comes from Justin Descano. Hey, Dom, you mentioned that April incident, the earlier one uh, where he hit Conforto. At the time, did you guys think that was intentional or there was a little more to that? I'm not saying it's an intentional, but if you look at the numbers, um, the Mets, our team, we're the most hit team in baseball. And, um, you know, we, we've been hit by the Phillies a lot, uh, whether we go back for years. So this is not something that um, just started occurring and something that we're just crying about. Um, we've been hit a lot. Just look at the numbers. Yeah. Uh, why do you why do you think that is, if you had to guess? Uh, good hitters, you know, they got to do something to get us out of our game. You know, we got a long lineup and uh, these guys are really good. So I feel like they're trying to make good pitches, get in on us. Uh, sometimes they slip and, uh, you know, hit us. I'm not saying every hit by pitch is on purpose. No, um, a lot of them are obviously, you know, mistakes. But when you're a good hitter, you know, they have to try to pound you inside. And then sometimes the ball just slips and you get hit. Dom, your final question tonight comes from Tim Healy. Do you think this is over or might it continue through the weekend, through the other games you guys have this year? I think we just got to focus on winning ball games. Um, you know, all I want to do is win, win every day. Um, I just come in trying to help my team win, and that's all I really try to focus on on a daily basis. We play them again another couple of days. We play them again, I think, later in the year. So um, I just try to win, just like I do against every uh, team, all other 29 teams. So I just can't wait to get back out there tomorrow and, and try to help my team win the ball game. And w when, when he did get your attention and you started walking back toward him, what did you say back to him after you didn't quite understand what he was saying to you? Uh, I said a couple of explicit things, but, you know, I, I, I'm ready. You know, I'm walking towards you. You know, you don't got to walk to your bench. If you're going to mother F me and follow me, then come get me then because I'm 60 feet away. So that's all I was saying. And, uh, I mean, obviously, 
it didn't escalate that far. But, you know, like I said, I'm a grown ass man, so I don't take none of that shit. Thank you.